Welcome to the Spires Midwifery-led unit at the John Radcliffe Hospital in Oxford. This video aims to provide expectant mothers within Oxfordshire an opportunity to view our facilities while our in-person tours are suspended due to the COVID-19 outbreak. We welcome women who are experiencing a straightforward and low-risk pregnancy who go into labour spontaneously between 37 and 42 weeks. If you don't think this is you, but you would still like to use the spires, please speak to your community midwife. The spires unit is located in the Women's Centre. There are 20 minutes drop-off car parking bays directly outside, which your partner can use to drop you at the front of the building. Please remember to bring your blue notes up with you. Use the intercom system for delivery suite to gain access to the building, then make your way to the lifts at the end of the corridor. The Spires unit is on the seventh floor and round to the right as you exit the lifts. At the moment, due to the COVID-19 outbreak, we ask that partners do not accompany you into the building until we have assessed you and assure you are in established labour. They should move their car to one of the main car parks while they wait. This is to protect the midwives and other staff members who will be looking after you. All staff members will be wearing PPE at all times throughout your stay. During your labour and postnatally, staff will be wearing gloves, aprons, face masks and goggles. While you are giving birth, your midwife will add a long sleeve protective gown. And if you are in the pool, she may also wear elbow length gloves and a protective visor. We understand that this can be a bit daunting, but it is for everybody's protection. When you come up to the spires, we will initially show you to our assessment room, where we will carry out some routine checks to ensure that you and your baby are both healthy and well. We will also assess your labour progress by asking you about your contractions, and we may offer a vaginal examination to assess your cervical dilation. Once we are sure you're in established labour, we will show you to one of our birth rooms. Your birth partner will be invited to bring up your luggage and join you at this point. To protect our midwives and other staff, we've had to restrict birth partners to one person for the duration of your labour and birth, but there is the option for you to set up a video call with others so they can support you remotely from home if you wish. The Spires unit has five birth rooms, each designed to help women relax and promote the release of natural pain relieving hormones. Three of our rooms have birth pools, while the other two are designed to promote an active and upright labour for those who may not wish to use the water. The children room has a multi-position and fully adjustable bed specifically designed to enable the maternal positions known to help labour progress normally. Our water peri room features an active birth couch which can be transformed and used to help you find comfortable positions whether you prefer to be standing, kneeling, sitting or lying down and the removable corner can be used to support you if you wish to be on all fours. Our other three rooms each contain a birth pool. The relaxing and soothing benefits that water provides can be very beneficial during childbirth and women often report a feeling of weightlessness and freedom of movement when labouring in water. We are still happy to facilitate labour and birth in water during the COVID-19 outbreak for women who have no signs or symptoms of the virus. However, you might be asked by some midwives to lift your abdomen out of the water while they listen to the baby's heartbeat in order to reduce their risk of infection. Whiten Room is our biggest room and features a large cloverleaf shaped birth pool. Knowles room is our light sensory room. It contains one of the two smaller oval shaped pools we have on the unit, combining the benefits of water and sensory lighting to create a very gentle and relaxing environment. Finally, Burcott room is another light, airy and relaxing room and contains the other oval pool. All five of our birth rooms are ensuite and have dimmable lighting which can be adjusted to your preference. In all of our rooms we have a variety of equipment to aid optimal maternal positioning in labour, such as birthing mats, 
pulls and stools. Remaining upright and mobile during labour can really help to promote your baby's descent down the birth canal into a good position for birth. Your midwife can assist you and may suggest different positions to help with this. We also have Bluetooth enabled radios so you can listen to your own music to help you relax but you are welcome to bring in your own speakers if you wish. To help support you throughout your labour and birth, we advocate breathing and relaxation techniques, as well as massage, heat pads and aromatherapy. We have a variety of aromatherapy oils available that are safe for use in pregnancy and birth, which can be used either in one of our diffusers or added to plain massage oil. We can also offer Entinox, otherwise known as gas and air, and method or diamorphine, which are opiate injections. You're welcome to bring your own TENS machine with you, but we do not have any available on the unit. The Spires unit is staffed by midwives and maternity support workers. However, should you need to see a doctor for any reason, we can arrange this quickly and safely. If you choose, or need, transfer in labour or after the birth of your baby, we can transfer you via the lift to our obstetric-led delivery suite, which is a few floors below. This also applies if you decide that you would like to have an epidural. Once your baby has been born, we will help to facilitate immediate skin-to-skin -skin contact and delayed umbilical cord clamping, and support you with your chosen feeding method. All midwives are trained to provide UNICEF baby-friendly breastfeeding support, and we are also happy to support mothers who wish to formula feed their babies. If you need to have any stitches, these can usually be done in your birth room. We have three postnatal rooms on the spires, each of which has a large double bed and an ensuite. If the unit has been busy and our postnatal rooms are all full, we will help you to move to one of our level 7 postnatal rooms, which are just down the corridor. Although all of our postnatal rooms are side rooms with en-suites, unfortunately it is not possible for partners to stay with you after the baby is born. Please be reassured that we are not planning to rush partners out straight after the birth. They will only be asked to leave once you are transferred to a postnatal room, which is usually an hour or so after your baby has been born. This is to reduce the flow of people coming through the hospital, as you'll likely be meeting different staff after your baby is born and we need to keep their exposure to other people at a minimum in order to keep everyone safe. Before you go home, we will need to perform a few checks on you and your baby to make sure you are both healthy and well. This includes a newborn hearing check and a full physical examination for your baby. This examination will be performed by a specialist midwife and cannot be done until your baby is at least six hours old. It is also important that you feel confident feeding your baby before you go home. During the COVID-19 outbreak, we are also offering contraception to all new mothers. The midwives will discuss your options with you before you are discharged. Once you are happy and ready to take your new arrival home, we ask that your birth partner brings their car to one of the 20 minute bays at the front of the building. We will assist you with your luggage to meet them at the front door. Your care will then be continued by your community midwives and your health visitor. If you would like to have your baby on the Spires unit, you don't need to book anything. Simply call us directly when you think you're in labour or if your waters break. Our number is 01865 221 666 and we are open 24-7. We look forward to meeting you soon.